What's up, Space Cadets? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Appear on Galactic Survival Let's Play. This is episode 13, and I'm go- Oh, where did he come from? All right, we're just gonna ignore him for now. I'm going to uh, show you what I've been up to in between videos. Um, I was going to- I had a plan to make an uh, underground, like, area for my ships. I was gonna have, like, imagine two, um, two hangars opening up on either side and like coming down into the mountain. Uh, the problem is I couldn't get the structural integrity to work. And maybe if I went into creative mode and I put in another three hours today, I might be able to get it to work, but I honestly don't have the time. I'll come back to this at some, come back to this idea at some point. It's just the, um, the hangar doors are so heavy, you know, it's just, it just doesn't seem to work. Um, I'm sure there's ways to make it work. I just, uh, you know, I'll, I'll mess around with it at some future point when I have more time. Uh, I've also made one of these minor lights. Um, wait, what are they called actually? Yeah, they are called minor lights. Yes. Pup minor light. It's pretty cool. I really like it. Um, and uh, I put one right there. I'm probably not going to need it there much more. Uh, so actually, let's turn it off. There's no point in having these on. Uh, can I... Do I have to be standing on it or touching it? Yeah, I think I have to be standing on top of it or something. There we go. Don't want to waste fuel. I'll probably take that apart though. Um, and I've, I've, I, they've got to do something about the uh, the fall distance in this game. There's some times where I just like hit stuff, not even very hard, and I just get hurt all the time. It's a little, it's a little uh, frustrating. It'd be nice to see. Like that wasn't even that hard. I, I don't think, but I don't know. Maybe it's just me. All right, let's kill this guy because he's starting to piss me off. It's kind of weird. I haven't seen these guys around here. I don't know where he came from, but he's dead now. He should have thought twice. Really? One piece of meat? That's a big monster for one piece of meat. Okay, so I've decided I want the hangar on the bottom of this base. So we're going to go ahead and take some blocks here. I'm out of iron, so I might have to go farming some iron. But that doesn't really bother me because that mining platform, I really like it. It, may, it makes mining a lot more fun than it used to be. So, that is really, really freaking sweet. All right, we do have a hangar door. The hangar door is going to be 14 by 7. 14 is an, uh, an even number, so we're not going to do that. We're going to do a 13 by 7. So, 12, uh, 6 and 6 is 12, so we got to go 6 on either side with one in the middle. Okay, so this would be the middle. Let's just, um, let's just clear this out very quickly. I wonder if uh, mountains collapse. I don't think mountain pieces collapse. I don't think they... Yeah, mountain... Like, dirt and mountains and stuff don't, like, mean anything when it comes to structural integrity. So, that's kind of odd. Maybe they'll add that later. I don't know. kind of feel like the structural integrity is a little bit too... Just a little bit too strict, maybe. I don't, I'm not sure. Okay, these things are really hard to get out of here. I will do that off camera because it's starting to annoy me and I don't think you guys need to sit through that. All right, so let's take this out. And take this out. My blueprint's done, but I don't need to put it down because it's not dark, so I won't worry about that. And this looks about right for the middle. Okay. So that looks good. You know, I could do two doors on this. Hmm. I could do two doors uh, going sideways. So that would mean the second number would need to be odd. Seven is odd. Do I need? Do I really need hangar doors that big, though? Also, I don't know how you put them in the middle. Because the hangar doors, when you try and put them down, the part that connects to the, to the base is underneath the hangar door. I... Don't, it, there might be a way to do it, but I don't know if you can place a hangar door by the roof. You know what I mean? Okay, I'm not going to do a double hangar door for this base. Um, I'm going to think about that in the future. But you see that little blue octagon looking lines? That is the part of the, the door that connects to the the piece that you're trying to connect it to. Is there a way to make that checker, that, that like octagon pattern thing on a different end? Like right now... The pattern's on the bottom of the door. I want to get that blue pattern on the top of the door so I can connect the top of the door to pieces. Um, let me know in the comments if there's a way to do that. I would really, uh, 
I would really welcome that information. But we're not going to do that today. We're going to we're going to just go ahead and make a regular door just cuz it'll be easier. Okay, so what did I say? 6, right? So 1 2 3 4 5 6. Give me a big door. That is okay though. The bigger the door the better. When I'm using Vex Rays uh creations in their wingspan, you know, I'm going to need a huge door. Probably not this huge, but whatever. Go bigger, go home, right? All right. So we're going to take this out. They should make an upgraded drone where you can use your tools with the drone. So I don't have to like try and jump up here. I could just maybe give my drone this drill and maybe he would be able to take care of it. Anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Alright, so we need to dig this out. Let's dig this out. Um, we need to run a thing across the bottom. Because, like I said, I don't know how to place stuff from the roof, you know, of the of the hangar door. So, we gotta have a place to put the bottom. Can I get this? I'd really like to be able to get that out of there. Oh, I can't get that little piece. It's kind of annoying. Let's turn on structural integrity mode. I think I know a way to get that little piece out of there, but I don't know if it's gonna if it's gonna work. I think you have to place a block in the way. You know what I mean? Like uh, anytime you see a little piece of the world like that sticking out, you place a block over it, and I think that might get rid of it. I'm not really sure. I was watching Skippy play, and he uh, he had a way to get rid of it, but I don't remember how the hell he did it. Okay, where do we want the floor to be? It'll be easier just to do this. Where do we want the floor to be? Is that a good spot for the floor? You know what? I'd like the floor to be one more down. Oh, I did put one one more down. Damn, how deep did I go with this? Um, that's a good spot. Okay. Structural integrity should not be an issue there. There we go. Alright, we're getting there, people. We're getting there. Now we need to take this out. Okay. And now we should be able to place this thing right in the middle. Let's clear some of this out. And place down our hangar door. This is going to be awesome. Okay. Hangar door coming in. And we want that one, and we want it right in the middle. That is the middle, right? I believe that's the middle. Is it not big enough? How many spots is it the other way? Seven. You know what? I might not have left enough spots going the other way. Hold on. One, two, three, four. F oh, my God. Not even close. Five. So should we raise it, or should we lower it? We got to raise it. All right. Let's get up there and raise it. We got to raise it two spots. And we got to take it out from the middle or... Well, actually... No, we could take it out from wherever. It doesn't matter. Got to raise it up two spots. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. I got some plans. Um, yeah, that'll work. Okay. Okay. So... One, two. That should be good. Here, let's just place it down now and make sure that's going to work. Okay, right in the middle, bro. Right in the middle. I believe that's the middle. Okay. No. Damn it. Hold on. We'll get it. Here we go. See, look at that structural integrity, man. That's like, that's no good. That is no good. I mean, it's it's just sitting on itself and it's, I don't think it's got the things underneath it. I don't think it's got the platform underneath it. It doesn't look like it does. Well, let's add some more blocks to it. We need to build the underneath part first. 
All right. Big projects, am I right? Yeah, it's not even underneath it. Wow. Well, I guess it's irrelevant. Uh, we can get it to work. That's all that matters. All right, let's dig this out a little bit more. One thing I would also like to do is when you're filling in with the filler tool, I would like you to be able to fill in stuff that looks like the rock around it. Because the filler tool is pretty cool, but it doesn't, um, it doesn't match up with all the rock around it. Man, I am really running out of this this stuff. Wow. See, the structural integrity is still an issue. That thing is fully supported now. Yeah, that's fully supported. That thing is just going to collapse under its own weight. Look, this, this, um... This door is fully supported and it's still not green. Like, how is it even possible? Like, yeah, there's. So, it seems like there's something a little weird with the structural integrity with this thing. It's fully supported and it's still not, like, green green. It, it's like having structural integrity issues. Not quite going to fall, but, you know, not quite where you want it to be either. Well, we got it working. We got it in there. We need to fill up the top. We'll do that, we'll do that later. Let's go ahead and place that. Man, we need a lot more blocks, dude. We're gonna have to go farm some iron. I'll probably farm some iron on. I'll probably farm some iron on. Yeah, I mean, I understand I'm like kind of crashing into rocks and stuff, but I really wish they would like lighten that up just a bit. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna farm some iron on camera today and probably cut out a lot of the rest. But uh, for now, let's just keep working. It looks pretty good. I kind of like the way it looks. I'm gonna hurt myself here. Oh, maybe not. Cool. I didn't hurt myself. Look at me go. All right, so this is going to be all metal. All metal all the time. All right, now what we do is we go into symmetry mode. And we need to find the very middle, which should be six from the side. There you guys. I like doing this much better. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, middle. Actually, middle should not be zero. It should be M, shouldn't it? Middle. Six, five, four, three, two, one. There we go. Ba da ba da ba. Cool. All right. So now we know where the middle is much more accurately. I mean, I pretty much knew where the middle was, but I like to do it with the uh, with the tool just to make sure. So there's no mistakes. All right. So what we're gonna do now is we are going to oh, let's get rid of this. There we go. What we're going to do now is we are going to come over here. We're going to use symmetry mode, which we already have on. Um, I don't quite remember how to use this. Hopefully it won't be that hard. Uh, do I just place one? I don't, no. I press N and then I go like that. There we go. Symmetry mode, baby. So you put that right in the middle. And now when you put these on the sides, they're going to go on both sides. Beautiful. Be beautiful. Love it. All right. Let's build this hanger. We are going to really run out of iron, aren't we? Well, that's to be expected. So the nice part about building a hangar inside here is because the dirt and the mountains aren't subject to gravity, they won't fall. So we don't need pillars supporting the roof. Unless we put iron up there, which we, we probably will do, but we don't have to if we don't want to, which is pretty cool. All right. Let's clear some of this stuff out. Probably gonna have to go get some iron. Um, we're gonna need to do a lot of a lot of farming, which I'm not really looking forward to. But it, you know that platform, that mobile platform right there, it makes farming a lot more palatable. I know it's like it doesn't make it any easier, but I don't know. There's something you know. If I'm having a good time farming, it makes it better. You know, even if it's not technically easier. Okay. Cool. How big do we want to make this place? I don't know. Um, do we want to power the base yet? No, no. I'm going to need iron because I want guns to defend this thing. Um, I wonder if there's... I wonder if underneath there's not... Like, there's a hole underneath or something. I don't understand why some of these blocks are having structural integrity issues. Like, is there something missing underneath? Like... No, that's... Oh, yeah, it's not 100% supported, I guess. So if I do that, that should help, right? 
Oh, it definitely helped over here. It didn't help that block, though. I wonder what's going on under this block. Yeah, see, if there's a little bit of a thing underneath the block, it causes structure to eh, whatever. I mean, it's not like it's going to collapse. And honestly, if I just do this, it's not a problem at all. Okay, so uh, how deep do we want to make this thing? Do we want to power it? I do want to power it at some point. Let's go up top and put some more dirt over it to kind of cover up the, uh, the part up top. And as far as this thing goes over here, this area... Uh, I'm not going to let that go to waste. I'm thinking about making a, a garden with like a glass roof thing over there. That could be pretty cool. Or a farm. Garden, farm. Nah, farm. I like the word farm better than garden. Alright, so we need something on top of this. So we, need, we definitely need blocks up here. So... Let's do... Well, let's put on structure and just in case something funny happens. Hey right, guys, I'm back working on the uh, working on the old base, and um, I think I've come out with a pretty interesting idea here with the windows, the glass. But they're not. But I put down two pieces of glass that aren't facing the right way. One's tinted and one's like whatever. So I'm gonna see if I can. I think there's a way to like change the tint on this glass. I don't remember though. Let's take a look. First of all, let's turn this off when we don't need it. Yeah, see how that's see how that's um it's see through up here, but tinted up there. I kind of want to change that, and I think I can with this gun. Did that did it right? Yep. Yep, that did it. Cool, cool, cool. Now, do I like this setup? It's pretty interesting. It's pretty interesting. I kind of I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Let's see what we can do with it. I mean, it definitely looks cool from the outside. I I think that's okay. Although. I don't like, I don't like it being right on top of the hangar, though. I gotta tell you. Well, does it matter? It does to me. From the outside, I don't think it looks right, right on top of the hangar. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take all this stuff out and we're going to. I'm trying to make my blocks work for as long for me as possible, but so that will be like that. So that's on top of the hangar. So then we could put the glass on top of that, or let me see. Let me see. We get the glass right here. Nope, not that. This. And wait, there we go. We put that right there. It looks good from the outside, but the inside is kind of like it's a little tricky. But I think I can do it. There we go. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, that looks cool. And then what we'll do is we'll still make this the floor inside. But what we'll do is we'll put some kind of staircase going up to the to the glass like area. Like we'll put this right here. Yeah, that'll work. Okay. And then what we'll do is um down here will be this is still gonna be the floor. Okay. But what you do is I put some like stairs right here, and then you walk up the stairs and you kinda look out look out like this. Yeah, that kind of works. I like that. Okay, so how are we going to deal with that going up? Should we have that just go straight through? Oh my god, look at that creepy freaking... <laughs> look at the creepy shadows. Should we have that go straight to the back or should we have it go up and then to the back? Kind of like it up and then to the back. Let's put some blocks right here for stability. Let's bring up... There we go, structural integrity. Okay, so this one doesn't matter, so that could be whatever. And... Do we have the glass go up? Or we just have blocks? No, we just have blocks. Um, that doesn't quite look right. Let's have this like that. That works. Yeah, that works. It looks pretty good from out here. It looks pretty good from the inside. We'll have that block probably go straight back to the end. Uh, how big is that going to be? So this will be the, this is going to be the upstairs, by the way. Um, the roof will be. I guess the roof could be right there. It doesn't even matter. We're going to figure out where the where we want the roof to be. I actually want the roof to be. A, I don't know. We're not going to be building anymore, so we could do that. 
Where do we want the roof to be? Oh, the top of the hangar. Well, this has definitely got to come out, this part. Can we take this out? We should be able to. Yeah. That works. That's good enough. All right. So, I, I don't know about having the... the I'm, I'm a little worried, not worried, but just, I don't know. I really don't like the idea of the hangar, the hangar roof being the same floor as the second le level. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So, um, I don't know. I kind of want to move this level up one more. But then I'm going to have two, you know, we're already going to be using a lot of blocks here. And if we make, if we make the roof of the hangar different from the floor of the next level, it's going to be twice as many blocks. It's a lot of blocks. And with, with the with the texture tool, you can actually uh, texture with the texture and symbol tool, you can actually set it up to color. Uh, wait, where is it? You can actually set it up to apply to the whole block or just one side. So there's no reason we can't have we can't have the uh, floor and the and the roof share the same block. There's no reason not to. So I think we will we will definitely do that. All right. So that's pretty much the design for the. The front of the base and the hangar and then we just have to design on the inside of the base the front of the base is all done and uh how high will the ceiling be in here so if this is the floor that's the ceiling the ceiling will be three high i might make the ceiling one more higher i might put one more set of these uh slope blocks up and then make the ceiling one higher but we're going to call this one here, guys. Uh, that's going to be it for episode 13. In between episode 13 and 14, I'm going to have to put a good amount of time into farming and stuff. Um, I'm going to have to try and find time. But please be patient with this series. Um, you're going to get more videos. They just, you know, it's a little bit harder to put them out as often as I'd like to when I just simply do not have the time to farm as much as I want to. So hang in there. You're going to get a lot more videos, and um, I can't wait to get to making them. So that's going to be it for episode 13. We'll see you next time for episode 14. Till then, take it easy.